Hello and welcome to the Bird Tales. Today is October 29th. I've got Skip with me and we just finished up a hunt on a WPA. Um, at first I thought this was going to be a, a bad day. Um, Skip was not being a very good dog. First uh, he was chasing some deer which we corrected quickly but I kind of thought by now we were done with the deer chasing thing. Um, but it didn't go on for too long and we were back to looking for birds and we were working along the edge of this crop field on the edge of the WPA and there was a drainage ditch that led off of the WPA and I didn't notice that Skip had continued down that drainage ditch but the reason I saw that he was down there was when the rooster started flushing off of this private land and I don't know what I would have done if he would have went down there and went on point anyways. That would have put me in a tough spot. Um, but the worst part about it was as these roosters flushed off of the private property, um, their flushing and cackling caused two roosters that were literally 70 yards ahead of us on the public land to flush and take off. If Skip would have just stuck with me for another 10 seconds, we would have been right on top of those birds. So we regathered ourselves and kept going. And um, I don't know if Skip, I don't know if he even knows what a grouse is to be honest. Um, I don't know that he's had a good point on a rough grouse yet. Um, he was just going and all of a sudden a rough grouse um, kind of came at me at an angle a little bit. Um, and I wasn't gonna let the opportunity pass by. So I took the shot, dropped this grouse, um, which was pretty good. Um, this isn't a spot where I would have ever expected to shoot a grouse, but you know the habitat's there. Um, there's lots of willows and some popples and stuff, so it's not that strange, but I guess I just wouldn't have thought that there'd be any grouse out on this unit. And so we just continued on, and Skip eventually did redeem himself. Um, he went on point and it was one of those eyes bulged out of his head, rock solid, there's absolutely a bird here points. And I walked up there and that bird held really tight. Uh, I moved the brush a little bit and at some point he just flushed and I got a shot off. Um, Skip retrieved him, not with, not before he mellowed them a bunch and made all of his tail feathers fall oh out. God. But you know, he brought them back. He pointed them. That's a pretty good day. So we wrapped it up and came back to the car after that. So that was it. I appreciate you watching. Stay tuned for next time.